What is up guys, it is Joe here from Joe Tours Wrestling and today we are reviewing the brand new released WWE 2K20 Smackdown Collectors Edition. Now, I have seen all of the information online, I have seen everything about 2K20, I know that it's pretty mediocre um, and... It does make me really wish that I didn't have to spend as much money as I did on this. Um, but nevertheless, I did, uh, and I did it for you guys. So here we are, SmackDown Edition. I'm going to be reviewing this. Uh, so without further ado, let's get into it. Um, it's covered in like the cellophane wrapping, so I just need to carefully cut it. I don't want to damage the box because obviously, you know, the box is always cool to keep. So let's open it up. Firstly, I can say it is significantly smaller than the collector's editions have been in previous years, mainly because it doesn't include a physical item like a pop vinyl. Uh, obviously, the Woo edition I got last year of 2K19 had the Ric Flair pop. Um, this doesn't have any pops, so it's literally just, you know, this. Right, I believe, is this a sleeve? I think it is. Yep, yeah, this is a sleeve. So here we are. Okay. Wow, no, I didn't expect that. So all of the information is on this like clear plastic sleeve and the box itself is literally just this really cool collage of pictures of significant moments in SmackDown's history. Uh, let's get this open. I believe we pull from here. Once again, I don't want to damage the box uh, too badly anyway. If I can, you know, prevent myself from damaging it, then I 100% will pull that out. Right, oh, here we go, guys. So, obviously, the main attraction here is the game itself. WWE 2K20. I have the Deluxe Edition, which includes 2K Originals content, the Bump in the Night DLC uh, that will be releasing very shortly. So, here it is on the back, obviously, 2K Showcase, My Career, 2K Towers, New Game Modes, and Streamlined Controls. That's not true. Uh, and 2K Originals. So, there it is, 2K20. We're going to put that to the side for now, as that doesn't matter. What we're here for is the physical collectibles. So, in this box, you can see we have, obviously, the different sections. Uh, we're going to start off with the smaller piece. I don't know what this is. Okay, right, it says WWE 2K20 on it. Is this the SmackDown ring mat, or is this the signature? Uh, let's have a look. Okay, great, it's got a sticker on it. So let me just peel that. Right, that's off. Now, how do I do this? Pull it from here. Like so. And we're going to pull this out. Facing you guys first. There it is. This is really cool, guys. I have a piece of the ring skirt from 2002 to 2008 on SmackDown. So as you can see here, uh, the lighting isn't great if my camera will focus. This ring skirt right here... This is a piece of that, which is absolutely insane. I own a part of history. Uh, WWE 2K20 on the back in black. This is really cool. Like last year, uh, we got a bit of Ric Flair's robe. But this, in my opinion, is, you know, like cooler than that. Like this is the actual SmackDown ring. Like so many people. Like we've seen this from 2002 to 2008. We've seen this apron pretty much every single episode of SmackDown. So that is badass as hell. We're going to move that to the side and we're going to get into the next bit, which is this big old box right here. Okay. Also, we have WWE Supercard content. I'm not going to be showing you guys the code. Uh, what I will be doing, however, is listing this on eBay. So, you know, if, you, if you're into Supercard and, you know, you want to have um, Mankind and The Rock um then of course just you know buy it but it's wwe 2k20 exclusive version so the only way you can get these is if you buy this edition of the game which means this is going to be going for quite a hefty price um so there we go move that out of the way and this is what i'm intrigued by what is this a big old box that says wwe 2k20 on it i believe this is the signed photo you either get edge Kurt Angle or Rey Mysterio, three absolute legends in SmackDown's history. I love all three of them. I really don't mind who I get. Um, so let me open it up and pull this out gently. I want to get it so it's like facing you guys. I need to make sure. Oh, 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 oh. There it is. We have Kurt Angle, guys. This is awesome. Look at that. Is this glass? 
No, it's just a really thick, like, acrylic plastic. Um, and here it is. Smackdown episode 334, January 13th, 2006. A returning Kurt Angle captures the World Heavyweight Championship in a 20-man battle royal. And there it is. Kurt Angle himself has signed this. This is absolutely insane. Like, this is awesome. So, I am very, very happy with the result of this. Um, moving on. There's nothing else left in the box. Yeah, that's everything. So, guys, just to go over it once again, we have exclusive WWE 2K20 Collector's Edition Supercard content, a signed acrylic plaque of Kurt Angle, an acrylic plaque with featuring a piece of the SmackDown ring skirt, and the WWE 2K20 Deluxe Edition, as well as this cool steelbook case. Now the question is, do I think it's justifiable at, at £139.99? My answer to you guys, no. I don't think that the price is justifiable. Uh, I would believe, you know, I think maybe £100 at a push is good enough for this. £139.99, not worth it. I'm, I've only done it because, obviously, I want to review it on the channel. But if you're just a normal consumer, just a normal kid, like if you're asking for this for Christmas and you're thinking about money wise, then, you know, you're better off asking for just the normal digital, uh, normal deluxe edition of the game and getting something else like get another game as well. Uh, getting the Smackdown edition is just not worth it, in my opinion. It is pretty much double. Uh, no, it's over double the price of the standard game, which is insane. So, yeah, there we go. WWE 2K20 Smackdown Edition. I do hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will now be installing this. And, uh, yeah, hope to see some 2K20 content very shortly. I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Stay tuned for more wrestling content, and I'll see you in the next video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Goodbye.